And the following contest is scheduled for one ball. Rolando Perez originally scheduled to face off against Kerry Awful here this evening. Kerry Awful falling ill, not playing hooky. We all saw the pictures on social media. But I can tell you who was in the back and who did not have a match tonight and was just chopping at the bit to get some of Rolando Perez. And that's stunned Marshall. That is right, a bit of a rematch of sorts from the main event of our last show. Of course, that was a tag team match, 865 Mafia versus the Hard Targets. Tag titles were on the line. Surprisingly, neither team walked away with them. Instead, they went to the Carnies. Carnies playing Carney games. We thought we were done with that. Coming into 2024, whenever Maxwell Classic was forced out as general manager and Carmen Michael took the mantle but Carney still found a way, still found some loopholes. Bell sounds, and this singles contest is underway. Rolando Perez and Stunt Marshall, 8-6-5 versus a hard target. Rolando immediately trying to play mind games with Stunt Marshall, ducking out of the way of the collar and elbow tie-up. Trying to get inside the head of Marshall. The eighth wonder of the world showing off that physique. Yeah. 
I don't know how well that'll work out for you, Rolando. We're gonna find out if uh, Rolando knows what he's doing here. I don't know if he realizes just how hard Stunt Marshall is. Well, he doesn't get hard, he stays hard. Ain't that a damn shame, drops to a knee and his hand's just as high as Rolando's was. You cannot underestimate Rolando Perez. Uh, as, as, many, as many negative things as we could say about him, one thing that you cannot say is that Rolando Perez is a bad professional wrestler because he is definitely not that. There's a reason this individual is signed with the National Wrestling Alliance. There is a reason that you see him on your television screens. Rolando Perez is a bad, bad man, but Stun Marshall, he ain't too shook about it. I mean, this is, once again, much like Rolando playing mind games, a little bit of mind games on the part of Stunt Marshall here. I mean, at the end of the day, Rolando Perez may have a little bit of a Napoleon complex to him. Mind games continuing up and over goes Stunt Marshall. Oh, Hate Hogan with the arm drag. Right into the hip toss. Wrestling 101 from the hate wonder of the world. Drop kick connects flush. Stump Marshall taking Rolando to camp in the early moments of this match. Now I think we're going to see how a high trim tab can count. It's every bit of it, and Rolando's feeling every bit of it. A little punch drunk out of the corner. Uh-oh. It's like he's going old school. No, I think he's going middle school, Scotty. Oh, oh, oh looking for it. Off the ropes, big boot connects. Goes with a pin, two, kicks out. And Stunt Marshall knew that wasn't gonna be it. Stunt Marshall, is, and as you have said, is very much having some fun, playing some games with Rolando right now, but Rolando firing back, showing Stunt Marshall that was a bad idea. But you also have to consider both of these men are very well aware that in the retinal tag team division, there are two teams that stand opposed to the Carnies. One is the 865 Mafia, one is the Hard Targets. Whoever comes out of this victorious may very well be the first to earn that shot against Awful and Iggy. We saw Donnie Primetime picking up a win in our opening contest against Rodney Rockchild. Stunt Marshall definitely looking to put a W Oh. On his singles record here as well. The strength of Stunt Marshall just dropping him right down like a sack of ice. The Ulta Hate Warrior. And the leg drop. Rolls him over for the cover. Lateral press. Arm across the face, but Rolando kicking out at two. I think he wants to get to the chopper, Scotty. Oh, looking for it. Wait, Rolando's fighting out. Rolando's fighting out. Looks like he, he might have got a hold of the eyes there, Scotty. Not a great vantage point for us. Oh, pulls him in and oh. Shoulder directly into that, that squared off ring post. Rolando charging in and hits the cannonball. That is the thing about Rolando Perez. When he gets going, he's absolutely barrel in that ring. We'll do whatever like it takes hooked. to win. Oh! But Stunt not letting it happen. Rolando Perez, such a master at using his entire body, all of his momentum, in so much of his striking offense. Look at that, kicking out the arm. He saw the only thing keeping Stunt Marshall in the ring was holding on to that middle rope, kicking out the arm, and now going to work on the arm of Stunt Marshall. Violently pulling away at it. And I mean, we've brought it up, Stunt Marshall's strength, utilizing those arms, throwing his opponents around. Lots of 
move on the part of Rolando to go after that. Stang and Senton isn't done, rolls him into the pin. Two. Just a two, says our official. Stunt Marshall might be starting to regret some of those earlier decisions in the match. Biting the arm of Stunt Marshall is Rolando Perez. I don't know if anyone who fights dirtier in that ring than the man known as Rolando Perez. Uh-oh. Off the rope. Biggest uh -oh. boot. Could it spell doom? For Hate it Hogan, is. two, no! <laughs> Catches the shot. As the crowd, the hit trim tab rallies behind Stunt Marshall, trying to bring the hard target back into this. But goes after those eyes once again is Rolando Perez. Perez got a tight hold across the neck of Stunt Marshall, trying to just drag as much air out of the lungs of the Haith Wonder of the World as he can. You see Stunt trying to fight back. Siphoning all of that oxygen out of Stunt Marshall. Away, but look at the strength. Picks him up, takes him to the turnbuckle. A big shot may have just put things firmly back in control of the hard target himself. Shoots him into the corner. Some Marshall flies oh in, my but God. there's nobody there. Just got a front row seat to a huge crash and burn on the part of Stunt Marshall. If it wasn't for that post, Stunt Marshall would have took us out. Rolando begging for that count out victory. Like I said earlier, willing to win by any means necessary. Up to a count of seven, Stump Marshall's trying to get back up and he finally gets back in at the count of eight. Every bit of that count to recover, bring himself back into it, but Rolando. More disrespect from a bad, bad man. Trying to get him up, but Stunt Marshall just too strong for Rolando. Shoots him into the ropes, ducks the shot, does Rolando. He's got him up. Wait, DDT! Rolando rolls him over away from the rope, hooks the outside leg. Last minute kick out, Stunt still in this. Both of these men have been throwing everything they have at one another. Now just wrenching back on those arms once again. Going after the arms is Perez. That knee dug right into the center of the shoulder blades as he pulls back on those arms, does Rolando Perez, but Stump Marshall still got a lot of power, still fighting out of it, but Perez wisely going to the legs, dropping Marshall right back down to the mat. Absolutely vicious is Perez refusing to relent, refusing to give in, wearing down Marshall every single step of the way. But wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, turns it back around and Perez still firmly in control. Marshall having a fight that much harder, tells the official he's not ready to call it a night just yet. Fires back up and just turns him inside out, does Marshall, oh. headbutt connects. Charging in, back elbow. Is it done? A little Sends bit of misdirection. 
Rolls them into a clothesline. When you zig, he zags. Might be looking for that X-Plex, and he's got it! Alega's hook cover is made, but Rolando out at two. I think that moment's hesitation was what cost Stunt in that moment. Wait a minute, what's he thinking here? Stunt wants to fly, going up to the high rent district, Scotty. Usually a place we see his tag partner prime time, but then, oh! Nobody was home. The headbutt connects right into the chest of Marshall. He's got him up. Connects with a flatliner. Leg is hooked. One, two, no! Oh! Stunt Marshall still in it. And you can see that look on Perez's face. What is it going to take? Look at this. I've already, we've already discussed how dirty of a player the man known as Rolando Perez is. I think he's got those brass knuckles in his hand, Scotty. The official sees it. He's warning Rolando, don't do it. Gears up for the shot, but gets caught. Could be getting to the chopper, but wait, wait, no. Ref Kev laid out. By the feet of Rolando Perez, some Marshall none the wiser. Well, that wasn't the Chapa, that was an airplane. A look at the feet of Stunt Marshall. Retribution could be coming for the man known as Rolando Perez. Perez just dropping. I don't think he has enough gas left in the tank. Wait, no, no, no. No, 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 not like this. A shame that such a fantastic match had to end this way. The deception of Rolando Perez ending things here tonight for Stunt Marshall. But Marshall's not done, Marshall's not done. He still wants to fight. And I think things are not over between the hard targets and the 865 Mafia. But it looks like Stunt has a nice souvenir to take with him.